What's up, guys? It's Raf in the Raf Cave. Welcome back to another video. Uh, this here is a short stream on home theater submissions. I put a post on my YouTube channel maybe a month ago and thought it would be a cool idea to uh, show off some Raf Cave Club members' home theater, talk about it, and see what it's all about, right? See what their stuff is all about. Because I love home theater and I'm curious to know what my club members have on their own so uh, i posted a link on my facebook channel the raft cave on facebook if you're not a member go ahead and join it it's fun and uh, i got a few email submissions from three members so i'm going to talk about their theaters so uh yeah i want to give a shout out to everybody that submitted thank you i think this is cool to talk about their home theaters too bad they're probably not going to be in here while i'm talking about it but you can watch it later. Drop a like, drop a subscribe, and uh, if you want to submit your home theater to me so I can check it out, then maybe we'll make another one depending on how many likes this video gets. Okay, so let's see what we can see here. Uh, right. I'm going to get into... What should we show first? All right, let's do Facebook first. All right, let me start this up. All right, let's see, let's see. And boom. Okay, so first submission is by Mitchell Vaughn and he has given us uh, a few pictures. I wonder if I can go full screen. All right, guys, let's see. Let me uh, fix the picture just a smidgen. There. Okay, what we got? <laughs> this is great. Walking into Mitchell Vaughn's theater. And I love the Vikings in the top middle, of course. Let's see. Got some Vikings memorabilia. I got some 49ers memorabilia. I like the Bumblebee 4K movie, prominently displayed. I see a big screen. I'm not sure what big screen it is. Looks like a uh, 65 inch, at least. And we got a Klipsch home theater system. Where do we start? Oh, and we got a theater projector. Yes, I like the conversion. So he's got a. Uh, electric screen that can automatically pull down with a switch which is really cool uh, let's see let's start on the far right so I like the Vikings uh, neon logo sign very cool it looks like a couple uh, clips towers not sure what the brands are uh, looks like you got a really nice blu-ray connection in the background a couple nice LPs on the top shelf Queen uh, REM uh, Elton John looks like uh two clip subwoofers i think they're probably 12s a couple dual 12s very nice i see the mk playstation 4 copy i wonder if we played yet mitchell send me an invite let's play uh, i'm not sure what's on top of the sub is that a collector's mask or something or i'm not sure what that is uh looks like we got a nice center speaker very good we got an lp turntable top middle shelf whoa uh, some more games and stuff on there. We got, uh, <laughs> we got, I, is that Reagan and Trump on the bottom there? For the two little statues? Uh, looks like maybe a router. A router and a switch. Maybe a switch. Router, something or other. Is that a CD player? Maybe a laser disc? I'm not sure. Bottom left. Uh, maybe a D D DVD player, Blu-ray player, to bottom middle. We have a Nintendo uh, Wii. Looks like some kind of special gold edition or something. Uh, other other uh, sub, we got Marcus Phoenix statue from uh, Gears 3. It's a collector's edition. I have two of those statues. They're awesome. A uh, copy of uh, Steelbook of Gears uh, 5, I believe. That's that one there. Now, let's talk about this tower. Mm. Uh, I see probably a Pioneer Elite on top there. Is that the processor? Got nice amplifiers, lots of amps. Emotiva. Like a lot of amps. Very nice. You got the Panamax 
power center. Looks like probably a 5100 or 5300. I'm not sure. Maybe one of those. Very nice, though. Uh, the creme de la creme monster power on the bottom. Lots of power in this guy's setup. Very nice. We got neon lights. And we got the Vikings ceiling colors. Very cool. Wow. That's a lot. What's up, love 80s? Zoom in. Uh, that is the most that I can zoom in. Unless I blow up the uh, the entire frame. Which I could do. But then you wouldn't see me. See? Then you wouldn't see me. Maybe I can put my face in the bottom corner. But that's the setup of Mitchell. Now, let's see the second picture. All right. J Just Games. <laughs> Change the ceiling. <laughs> He's got some. Uh, I thought he had a, a Cowboys something jersey. Now, this must be the side shot. This is the left side of his theater. It's called Mitch Man Cave. I like that. We got some uh, home theater plaques. Kind of like what I have. I have a few of those. Very nice. Uh, I see some Cubs. Lots of sports little helmets over here in the in this little corner here. See my mouse? And we're, yeah, we're, we're going to do this. Lots of sports helmets there. We got some nice uh, alcoholic beverages here. Strong stuff. Cousin Stealing Greenway. I like that. Absolutely awesome. Vikings represent. Popcorn Maker. Jeez. Lawrence Taylor. Jim Brown jerseys. John Elway jersey. Wow. Tons of gaming headsets. Which one is your favorite, Mitchell? Inquiring minds want to know. R2-D2 down here. We got some more LPs in the corner. Bumblebee, of course. We got a Texan something uh, something in the bottom right. Uh, we got a couple different monitors on the wall. Maybe showing some other sports games at the same time. This guy's a sports fan. Sundays are popping here. Must have the Sunday NFL ticket, I'd imagine. Let's talk about this uh, wall outlet that's straining over here. <laughs> What's going on right here? This is a clump of uh, uh, AC adapters going everywhere. Uh, let's let's get a nice surge protector there. Hopefully he's got something nice here. And uh, looks like we got some blankets on the on the couch back here. Not sure what that is, but uh, that's a lot there. I'd like to see the right side. Maybe he has a submission on the right side. Drop a like on there. Very cool. Very cool. Let me drop a like on that top one there. All right, we got Frederick Vasquez. I'm not sure what that is. That's a video or something. Not sure if that's a home theater submission or not. I don't think it is. Here we go. More Mitchell Vaughn. I love it. Drop a like. All right, this must be the left side. Right side. This is the right side. Holy moly, look at these helmets. What's up, Ghost? Now, we got a lot of helmets here. A lot of teams. The best team right here, this this bottom bottom right right here. Right here. That's right. We got we got the, uh, the Cowboys in the middle here. Ghost, is this yours? Wow, we got some signatures in too. Got some signed helmets. Very cool. Looks like he's a military man. Not sure if this is him or not. We got a nice speaker. We got a couple speakers here. Hung from the ceiling. Very nice. Still purple ceiling. Awesome. Is that a Bud Light neon sign? Oh, another Vikings helmet in, in the glass case. That's a special one. Vikings, twins, wild stuff. Lots of Wii remotes here. Love the Viking pillows and blankets very cool we got a boxing helmet in glass wonder who that is oh the viking sign and we got the screen pulled down guys screen is down are these speakers up here oh that's awesome go vikes on the chalkboard great stuff that's quite the man cave guys that is quite the man cave uh, I think this is a zoomed-in picture of what we just talked about, I think. 
Resident Evil 2, Resident Zero Dawn, Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Is that the list of games you're, you're tackling there? Very cool. Very cool, very cool. Is this the back? Holy moly. Look at these signatures on these. Serious, man. Serious collector we got. Joe Namath? Joe Montana, maybe? Or John Madden? Not sure. This looks like John Elway. Oh, Dan Marino. Dan Marino? Uh, Joe Montana. Yep. And then not sure, not sure. Uh, Jet Jim Klaus jersey. Eric Dickerson. That's pretty sweet. We got Man Cave Rules. My Cave, My Rules. No sitting in my chair. Keep your hands off the remote. Women by invitation. <laughs> Bringing food is strongly suggested. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> yeah, that's good stuff. Drop a like. Bam. Mitchell Vaughn, quite the man cave. Holy cow. Well, that's it for this uh, part of the uh, show and tell here. Now let's move on to the emails. Um, and first one, let's see here. We got Bear Theater. Let's do that one first. Mr. Bear Theater. You know Bear Theater. Bear Theater stops, stops by a lot. Who dad? <laughs> What's up, noob? All right, so Bear Theater. Looks like he went shopping at Best Buy. Picked up some Polk. Uh, looks like a... I don't know if that's a sub or a... Um, T15. It's a small box. It doesn't look like a center channel. I'm not sure what that is. Dead in a receiver. Clip sub. Okay. Okay, here we go. Looks like he just moved in. Just building his theater. I wonder if I can zoom in a little bit more. Nope. All right. Uh, I think that must be a Sony. He always talks about the Sony 930. Must be the Sony 930. Uh, okay. Oh, you got the Polk Towers too. It's like an open box. Clip sub. Always some good deals at Best Buy if you look. T30. There's the center channel from Polk. And we got Dolby Atmos upfiring modules. Those go on top of your front speakers for uh, Atmos effects. And got the receiver plugged in. Still doing the doing the hookups. Looks like this is a router, a, a, like a mesh mesh uh, node. One of the mesh nodes here. Uh, looks like he's setting up his system. Not sure what the movie is. I uh, can't tell. All right. Looks like he's watching some uh, sports here off another Sony TV. A couple nice 4K pickups, Overlord and Aquaman. I like the coupons for uh, is this carry out. Is that Pizza Hut? No. Caboose? I don't know what that is. Best Buy receipt. Dolby Atmos, feel every dimension, every dimension. Looks like it's all fired up, looking great. There we go, back shot. We got the Polk Towers hooked up. We got, what's this on the floor here? Is that a PC? What is this? Got the keyboard, mouse, must be a PC right here. And then uh, center speakers on the bottom shelf. Hmm, kind of tough to put a center channel, huh? Right below the screen. But Atmos, got high ceilings here, so that all sound really good off the ceiling. Where's the subwoofer at? Should be in the corner over here. Lots of remotes. Looks like you just finished some uh, some dinner here. Not sure what this is all about. Nail polish? What is this? All right. Very nice. I don't know what's going on here. What are they about to do here in bed here? What's going on here? <laughs> Bear Theater. All right. Bear Theater. Next up. Home Theater Man. That would be Alex. Home Theater Man. Looks like he just bought this tower here. That can hold a lot of weight, too. Thick glass shelves. Very, very strong construction. That'll hold a, that'll hold a ton of bricks, easily. Looks like the Anki 11,000s on the bottom. Uh, I'm not sure this is here. Got the Xbox One X 
and a huge uh, hard drive at the Seagate hard drive. Not sure what this top one is. And then we have the uh, uh, really nice Panasonic Blu-ray, one of the better ones. All right, here we go. Now this is going to be a Samsung uh, 65 Q90. And then we have the Klipsch Towers, very nice. Great center channel. Nice symmetrical design here, very clean. Be nice if they were spread out a little bit more, but I think he has a, a corner space here. Clean setup. I think Best Buy hooked this up. Surge protector on the top of the fireplace, not being used. Looks like we have a bunch of outlets uh, not used here. Uh huh. We got a clip sub here with a Panasonic remote, TV remote, dish network, hopper remote. Onkyo receiver remote here, and this is the nice Logitech remote you just bought. I think this one costs like $450 too. Very expensive remote. Better do everything. Three separate Xbox controllers. Looks like we've got a multiplayer party going on in Home Theater Man's home. All right, here we go. A little bit more clean now. Uh, I'm not sure what these top things are. Not sure what those are. But, uh, okay, Panasonic up there. Looks like we've got a long power cord going across this way. I'd recommend getting an extension cord for that and funnel it all down the middle there. Keep it a little cleaner there. Uh, this must be the um, interface for the remote. That'll send uh, RF signals all over the room to control uh, the equipment from anywhere uh, when, when the remote is uh, used. Uh, hard drive here. And this one here looks like the two-channel amplifier to power up some Atmos speakers. And then uh, we're missing uh, the receiver. I think you had to send it in for repairs or something. Uh, mono price zip ties, yes. They look like zip ties. All right, so we have some surround sound. This must be the, uh, the right surround with another sub, possibly. More zip tie action. Logitech remote charging up. I like the LED lights, touch screen, very cool. This must be the uh, Atmos speakers or the back rear, back top speakers, back Atmos speaker. I'm not sure which ones those are. All right, we got LED lights behind the screen. Glow in that green Xbox colors. Very nice. And lots of cables come out of the wall. Clean setup, nice zip ties. And this must be the subwoofer cable and power cable going to the sub. Nice. That would be Home Theater Man. Alex, great job. Awesome stuff. And we're going to round out the Home Theater submissions with Fred215. Fred215. Let's go. All right. We have a AC Infinity. This is a uh, an air cooler. Uh, it sends air either pushes air down or pulls air out of receivers or any kind of equipment that uh, produces a lot of heat. Uh, this is a Marantz, looks like, uh, I'm not sure what number that is. Nine channel amp, so 11.2 processing, nice. Monolith multi-channel power amp for improved power. Got another uh, cooler here as well. And the bottom must be the Blu-ray player. Not sure what uh, brand that is. Fred's IMAX Experience. I like that. Looks like we got Sam Samus here. This is a Metroid. A nice air freshener. Spits out some clean air. Some yummy air every few uh, every few moments automatically. Very cool. Looks like he has the uh, Batman The Dark Knight collector set. I have that too right down there. Superman. Of course. All right. We've got lots to talk about here. Very cool. Klipsch, of course, number one home theater brand. Always recommend Klipsch. And Michael Myers, the shape, always love it. And lots of lots of stuff here. What what do we got here? Uh, uh, Hello Kitty there. Uh, Iron Man Hulk, very nice, busting out the wall there. A couple nice SVS speakers behind you here. Got. Uh, Saw here. What's the name of that dude? I don't know the name of the dude. This is uh Fred. Is this uh Fallout Fallout guy right down here? Uh, looks like Mario stuff there. Child's Play Chucky. Uh, Double Dragon. 
very cool gizmo i like it gremlins over here some clowns not sure who that is some other stuff here toad from mario this is a big uh what do you call these here big pops big pop right here who's who's this guy not sure all right next what we got here adam bomb from uh this is cabbage patch cabbage patch kids i remember those a couple nice neon lights not sure what this thingamajig here is got some wire maintenance coming down all right here we go this is the front of the room looks like got uh this is probably a 55 inch screen daft punk playing very nice tunes check out this uh deadpool i like that svs towers clean very very cool with the shiny black gloss finish that's nice and then we got some other stuff here lots of mario references nintendo old school guy i like that uh what does it say man man clock the man clock um can you turn that down thank you all right what we got here this must be is it tomb raider so it can't be zelda it looks too i'm not sure who this is but very nice very very nice very clean very clean where's the subs at i gotta see the subs i'm not sure where the subs are is that uh solid snake can't tell that or vendetta one of the two all right all right very cool uh, i'm not sure the brand of these uh top height speakers are uh but nice placement very cool yeah it looks like tomb raider i think that's tomb raider that's laura croft uh is that the back of the room again let me see if i can uh, rotate this all right a little bit clear closer cleaner picture all right good guys chucky right here very cool uh what else did i miss oh so that's hulk that's the big hulk dude the pop then pennywise uh is that freddy krueger pop hulk buster and some kind of wolf thing here that's awesome thanos on top so you got big hulk and thanos pops i like that very cool is this ash williams no oh, nightmare on elm street nightmare on elm street 3 nightmare on elm street part 3 i like the horror rep references very cool room uh ash evil dead nice lots of stuff oh it's cool we got alien we got predator we got ripley face hugger egg chewy we got old school Nintendo arcade. Awesome. Six button layout. How many games you got in here? Captain America coming off the wall. Very cool. Uh, looks like this is uh, this is the uh, the Matrix. This is, um, what do you call those? Sentinels? This is a Sentinel. I used to have one of these Sentinel toys. I lost mine or broke. I don't know what happened to it. But yeah, this one's cool. This is a Sentinel. Pac-Man, of course. Very cool. Walking Dead. And oh, you gotta rotate this, man. You gotta rotate. There we go. Looks like the gaming setup. Whoa. Ultra wide monitor. Kick butt PC. Giant speakers on the desk. Holy moly. We got the Hulk pen. We got some chargers here. We got nice, nice cool stuff. Switch over here. Audio equipment. We got the Google, Google Wi Fi puck here uh nice monitor that's really wide woo that's cool gaming headset good stuff beavis and butthead they're coming back to new show coming out avengers infinity war awesome awesome nice gaming pc man giant svs sub holy moly take care of this bad boy man you gotta take care of this beast annabelle pop uh not sure what else is over here unplugged usb cables all right that is it that is it well i want to thank all you guys for submitting your home theater to me it was really fun watching and looking and picking out everything hope you liked it if you want to see more of these just submit more to me in the email below and uh i will i will check them out on another one all right, guys, thanks for watching. I'm going to head out. I'll see you guys next time. Home theater rules. Raph out. See ya.